call this meeting of the Flannel Club to order. Claire Flannel, Scott Flannel, Angel. F awesome. Where is your flannel? I'm wearing red. Acceptable. All right, we're back. We are trying more things. You guys know how this works. International market stuff. What do we got? Start this off. We've got thick water. Coconut drink. Bebita de coco. Hooray. That, those chunks are suspended. Mmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are some chunks. It's got aloe, coconut. I feel like I should be rubbing this coconut on my skin. Coconut should be brown, should it not? I also, it says Aloe Garden, but that's clearly the font of a chain restaurant that we're not going to say the name <laughs> of because they're not paying us. Oh, we're too mercenary. Yeah. I see what you're saying. It's fat and cholesterol free. Um, it's got vitamin C. Refrescante. Mm -hmm. Please. Hydrante. Please recycle. Hydrante. Ingredients, purified water, cane sugar, coconut, also known as the devil's fruit, jelly, artificial coconut I flavor. Like coconut. Well, you're not wearing flannel. Uh, it, it's basically a water nut, mm. which is fine. Mm. Oh, I I will just re restate my my case of I am not a coconut guy. It smells like coconut. I'm mm, sure it does. I don't know your stance on coconut, so my stance on coconut is texture not so good, taste good. Shredded coconut, no. Coconut rum, yes. It smells like sun lotion. Yeah, it does smell like sun lotion. <laughs> it's kinda not a good like, thing. Kind of tastes like sun lotion, too. Oh. Uh, tastes like coconut. I really, I hate, I hate coconut. <laughs> I just, we got a bag of Halloween you have candy. To take a sip. I'm going to. I'm stalling for time. I know you are. We gave all of our almond joys away. So you were a joyless household? I don't like the chunks though. They're they're the chunks in this are tougher than the aloe yeah. drinks I've had in the past. Maybe they're chunks of coconut. No, they're just they're aggressive. It's like someone put sugar and sun lotion in a blender <laughs> and forgot the rum, and it it's not leaving my tongue, and it's coconut, and I don't it, I mm 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 mm. Yeah, by all means. So my 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 que my question is, and this is a genuine this is a genuine question. If you enjoy coconut, if you actually enjoy coconut, why? Like I'm not even trying to be like. Please tell me why do you enjoy coconut? Because it is just awful. <laughs> Slightly sweet, kind of tropical. Goes like well it. with lime. I don't like the chunks. This was made in New York. The product of Korea, which is the truth. You okay, Scott? Uh, you know, I'm here. I'm here. I will, All I right. will power through. More coconut right yeah. in. Oh, this looks healthy. I don't like it. Organic mulberry? Sweet and delicate mulberry? dried Ooh, like mulberries. mulberries. Ooh. Mulberries are I'm... good. The only, air quotes, sweet and delicate mulberry, dot, 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 since 1993. There's some very <laughs> questionable punctuation happening here. But... Before 1993, mulberries, there. then in 1993, the Great Mulberry War happened, and we did not get our mulberries and the fact until that they, today. They insist on doing air quotes around every single sweet and delicate, and I don't know what to make of that. Also, the sunny fruit difference begins at the source. He's me or turkey. So let's see if I'm going to oh. turkey's fridge again. Oh, you're in trouble now. You are in trouble. Turkey can't get me. They got to get in line behind everybody else. Mm. Hello, dog. Oh, it's a bag full of littler bags. Oh, that's actually convenient. Ah. <laughs> Even smells healthy. It, it, oh, it does. It, it smells vaguely like when you walk into one of those health food stores. Gluten free, no sugar added, good source okay, of fiber. Well, that's Are you missing that coconut right now? Mm, no, no, <laughs> not in a million. That looks like bird food. Like, you know those, like, hanging things like raisins. Of just the brown that you put in a cockatoo's cage. That's what this looks like. Yeah, this is this is mulberry. Or it raisins. would if I could get it open. I, I am a smart here, creature. Here you can share. You can share some. <laughs> this I is mulberry raisins. Primate. Uh, expires December eleventh, so still apparently good. Edgewater, New Jersey. You gotta be better than coconut. It smells like a raisin no. vaguely. Let's see how air quotes sweet that and delicate like raisins. It is. They're raisin-ish. They're very lighter. It's a very, very light flavor. I don't prefer my mulberries this way. 
It's a light flavor until it tastes like feet. Then it hits you. <laughs> wow, that's a that's a ride. This should be in like a sad granola bar, and once again, Where's in a health coconut food water store. Back? It's still going. It tastes like it's good for me. Bad chocolate keeps going and going and going. Yeah, what the? It's still better than coconut water just no. on principle alone, but no, it's not. It tastes like, oh, it's in Edgewater. It, it tastes like runoff from one of the power plants. That explains it. Thank you, evil producer. Hey, but Jersey got a shout out, so hey, I'm, I'm happy. Bring back the coconut. I got a dry one. <laughs> <laughs> Stab it all. I didn't know what happened oh. until I took the bite. All right, thing number three. Let's let's do this. Whoosh. Oh, it's more no, chunky. Let's go. I don't like that color. I don't like them chunks or the fact that it's. Well, let's see. Coconut milk drink with not a de not cocoa, a de cocoa banana flavor. Cocoa water. Okay. Coconut water. Hydrate naturally. Shake well. Separation is normal. Banana flavor. Sounds like a divorce counselor. <laughs> Banana flavored coconut water, milk, whatever. Bana Pro product of Thailand. Banana flip coconut. <sighs> Why do my hands not work today? <laughs> Smells like fingernail polish remover. There is a very acetate tone to that. Well, that's what you want to hear. <laughs> 150 calories? For best taste, serve chilled and consume within 24 hours. Separation is normal. Like Thanks for the life advice. Relatively inoffensive, but it makes me think of that banana milk that I could be drinking right now. And like then it makes me sad. Okay, I can palate this. Because either I didn't get any coconut, or the coconut is very, very light. Mm -hmm. But the the banana the banana milk we had previously, far and away better, mm -hmm. better than this. And this, these chunks are. I will say this. Um, if more um, solid. Mm -hmm. If you didn't tell me there was coconut in here, I would not have guessed it. So this is this is gaining some points back based off of the one singular tiny baby sip that I took. It's it's the difference between coconut milk and coconut flavor. Mm. This, so this is split hairs. Sure, this is actually not. The more I think about it, not bad. Inoffensive, I think, is the word of the day. But would you go out and Kooji. buy it? No. Maybe as a joke. So here's what That's I hate. A joke, yeah. Joke's on us. Here's what I absolutely hate. Hydrate naturally. That's called water. I kind of like this. And I'm very mad at myself for that. <laughs> Separation is normal. I just, Who, I don't know. Will we have a tasty uh, treat? Lupo. We're going to get lupus? No, lupo means wolf. It says share. It does say share. And marbles. They don't tell me what to do. Share marbles. So I don't want to share your marbles. Oh, I lost them years ago. All right, what do we got? Oh, that is so tiny. Wow. Did you bring your readers? No. Let me use my special eyes. Yes, use your youth. <laughs> youth. Solon, producer, fabricant. Halal certi certificate. Oh, it's halal. Does not contain trans fats. Okay. Made in Turkey. Good grief. You're in trouble. <laughs> I have not teed off the Turks today. But we'll today? See. <laughs> Do not expose to direct sunlight. Oh, uh, well, I think we're good. Okay. <laughs> we're a bunch of actors. We're all pasty, horrible <laughs> creatures hiding in the corner. Oh, wow. It's like I go out in the sun. Okay. Ah, you know, comparatively, ah. comparatively, you know, you're not. I am. Get in there, Chewy. Oh, God. Oh, wow. It's a okay. load. Oh, that was dense. <laughs> that is... That's scary. Cool. That is a dense loaf of... Does anybody have a knife, or are we just going to have to tear it apart like animals? 
Oh, we have a producer with a sharp object. Oh, yeah. Oh, magic knife. Food safety? I don't know. Or <laughs> you good? You got a good? I was afraid you'd about passed out for a second there. I thought you were just diving straight in. <laughs> Which you know is valid. Oh. I was smelling it. I know you were. We could all tell. Oh, hey, look, it folds out for oh. easy. Uh... This is a very fake cake, but okay, okay so here's my uh, question. Are we, we going to go center? We got to go center. We got to get like, a, gotta... cross, a cross cut here. Let's get right across the little cross section. Hold Ooh. it up and show them. Oh, that's um. It's more coagulated chocolate sauce. Yeah. But... Yeah, well, just a couple chunks. Coagulated here. is a word you really like to use in terms of your cakes. Yeah. All right, grab a. Everybody grab a. I like the butt pieces. You want the butt? Okay. That's um. That is dense. It's sticky. Almost it's more like, like a brownie. Chocolate. Yeah. In consistency. Oh. Almost like a brownie. Oh, she thick. Mmm. It's okay. Good. It's good moistness too. Like it's a good level of moist. It's fine. I'm the, not a brownie fan, but... The yellow cake is kind of... Meh. There's a slight citrus tinge to it, although I think that might be on the uh, sticky stuff on top. <laughs> it's there. It's uh, very crumbly. <laughs> you, know, just, you know what you could do with this? You could... Um, Have it with coffee? Yes. Oh, oh that of sounds course. good. Of course. You could take this, slice it up, and then take it to like a little function or get together, and like, look, I made dessert, and everyone will go, oh, it's so lovely. <laughs> How did you get it so moist? And then you can just come up with some Put recipe. Ice cream or... on top of it. Ice cream would be good too. I'm going more like social manipulation, mm -hmm. but ice cream works. D tell different people different secret ingredients. Throw them off the trail. It, although it, oh, interesting. If you, if you get the right angle, it looks like it has bookworms. Because there's little holes. <laughs> My cake has worms. <laughs> See, now turkey's going to come for you for once. Uh, I deserve it. They got to get me sooner or later. So, <laughs> we are... We tried uh, four more things and have been driven slowly insane by the evening. So... So many chunky drinks. This started it. No. The well, crazy. Mm. Or this. Well, we had, we started with this. I with like the, that. the coconut. Except for the chunks. Who, is, uh, who is insisting on all these chewy drinks? Who are you? Can you please stop? Because I, you're ruining things for everybody else in the world. I really feel like drinks should just be liquid. Yes. Yes, they should. Yeah. Because we have solids. It's called food. Uh, all right. You're going to make jello. Make jello. Yeah. So, coconut water. Uh, obviously, I despise coconut, so I'm going to say I don't like it. But some people, it's their thing. <laughs> and, you know, we won't judge them too harshly. Uh, from there, we went on to the uh, the mulberry. The sad health food. Yeah. Slash possible bird food. And I love mulberries, but I don't love those. We, we were talking during the break about maybe if you rehydrated them in booze, they could be like a little thing, but... But then you would just taste the booze. Honestly, I'd rather just taste the booze. Exactly. Were... At that point, just drink brandy and leave the mulberries in the store. I can see why people like them. Like, if you're on a health food kick, if you want something that starts off like a raisin and then betrays you, sure. Yeah. Go for the mulberry. Not my thing. Which, considering what the baseline for raisin is. Mm, yeah. Uh, from there, we went to the... I really want to not like it, but mm -hmm, the, mm -hmm. the banana coconut milk. Banoconut milk. Yes. I'm not even going to try because I know I'm going to mess that up. Uh, surprisingly okay. Surprisingly palatable. Not my thing, but, you know, if I were dying in the desert, sure. And I can, I can see. Yeah, if I was dying in the desert. <laughs> I like that's our bar. But if you were dying in the desert, would you drink the chunky coconut? If I were dying? Like... How close to dying am I? Like, do I have, I like, a day? <laughs> or do I have... Or am I going to well, get yeah, killed if I try to... going to keep it for mm. herself. I might not share. Well, speaking of sharing, uh, our final thing was our uh, um, Lupo wolf cake thing. This, um... I think, honestly, I think you summed it up best during the break <laughs> of, it's not very good, I'm going to have another piece. Yep. 
It's so some cake just be that way. You know, it's not great. It's not bad. It's cake. Yep. All right. I hereby call this meeting of the Flannel Club closed. <laughs>